Hello all, thank you for your attention. We are two George Mason IT students, and for our senior capstone project, we were paired together with this wonderful organization to help enhance their website. So unfortunately, our whole team wasn't able to come tonight, but uh, they sent two of us, and I'll give a quick introduction to our uh, whole team. So on the left, Tamia, she's our team leader. She is a uh, cybersecurity concentration. She's interested in cryptography. She had a summer internship with SAIC, and she is a public notary and peer mentor, mentor to it. Then we have Chris, who is a network and telecommunications concentration. He is pursuing his career in systems administration, and he contracts with Sprint Sunrise Valley. Next we have Farheen, who is a database and programming concentration, who is interested in technical writing and is currently tutoring at George Mason's Writing Center. Now we have Luis, who is a database and programming concentration as well. He is interested in the future of AI. And then we have me, John. I am a cyber con cybersecurity concentration, interested in desktop support. And over the summer, I was a help desk internship. I, had, I was a help desk intern for independent project analysis. Yay. Okay, so I don't want to take too much of your time, so I'm just going to go through this one chapter a little bit that outlines what we're going to do for this JC. Uh, as John mentioned earlier, our main focus is enhancing the website. And along with that, you can also see that we're going to add a mobile app that's going to provide some uh, more brief and direct information that the website might have that someone that maybe just wants to look on their phone and not bother going to the PC to look at. And uh, along with the website, we'll also be updating uh, things like the brochure template that you use for your events. Uh, we're working with somebody that Gigi has been contacted us with, uh, for the logo design. Uh, we're also gonna be working with uh, making some event tracking software on the website so that you can know when events are gonna happen, sign up for them and uh, also start up events so that everybody can get information relating to that. And lastly, we're, uh, we also got a really big uh, suggestion by Gigi to try and improve the calendar that you currently have. Currently it's not used and it's uh, obsolete, so we really look forward to improving that. And um, another big thing that we saw that was a problem was uh, there really was a uh, there, there was extra steps on the way to actually donating to the actual GMU website. So our plan was to provide a direct link rather than providing a uh, tree of links that you had to go through in order to get to where you end up being in the end. Mm -hmm. And um, the, another thing was a back end uh, addition to the website. This includes a login page for members so that only members have access to creating uh, dates for the calendar or events. Um, Non-members can take a look and see what events are coming up, but they can't interact with it fully. Only members that have a username and login will be able to do that. And uh, of course, we'll have that encrypted so that any uh, important information you might be using for passwords or uh, data for your profile won't get out to the public if uh, there were to be a problem in the future with that. And uh, aside from that, that's pretty much all we're gonna do. Uh, as I mentioned at the beginning, the main focus is to improve the website, and it's going to take until May of next year to finish that. So hopefully you guys look forward to that, and that's pretty much what our group is going to be focused on for this next couple of months. Thank you. Great thank job. You. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Do you have any questions for these gentlemen, ladies? you want to share something about the Cookie Jar Club? Okay. So a little bit more information about the Cookie Jar Club. Uh, we don't bake cookies, we raise dough. Yes. We help the college students, the EMP students, and step students. Um, so Cookie Jar Club has been around since 2010. And with the help and networking of many women professionals in their career, they have come together with one goal, one purpose, and that is to build um, and raise funds for students for great cause. Um, who otherwise um, are facing many challenges that first-generation students face, particularly around financial um, need and things of that nature. Um, to this point, they have, in the last five years, 
um, established an endowment at George Mason University that is now over $38,000. Our goal is to continue to grow this endowment to continue serving more students who are coming to Mason. Just to give you an idea how many AP Mason students are at Mason, we have over 218 students at Mason now currently. We have 662 middle and high school students in the program with plans to just grow. And so how can you become a member? So hopefully soon we're going to see this website launch. Um, to become a member, it's just you know $10 a month um, to um, help uh, give towards the endowment. You know, what we say is skip, a, skip, skip one lunch, uh, and then you can really give that funds to a great cause and just helping our students because definitely many of us, I know we have two alum in this space, myself, I'm an EIP alum, so I'm Jessica Vargas, and um, definitely my parents came from El Salvador, Civil War torn to country, person in the family didn't know what to do. So um, with the help of different partners and Cookie Jar Club, um, we have women who can empower us, who can help get, help us, but also us paying it forward. So. I'm the first EIP alum to become a Cookie Jar Club member, and I invite all my other fellow EIP alumna and also the current women in the area to join, okay? And then, as you saw tonight, you know, this is a really great time, you know, we can talk about serious things, we can have fun together, um, really be in community, um, and we really want to get input so that we can connect and network with other professional women, um, but really do something that speaks to what our interests are. So, you know, having socials, you know, maybe some career, maybe some mentoring. We really want to get some feedback from new members and current mentors on what we can do in the future, things that really interest us. You know, so definitely want to hear that input. All right, thank you everyone. And thank you to Brian's Grill for allowing us to have this event here. We are hoping to have the event here one Thursday out of each month. So tell your friends that we plan on having this again and, and tell them how much fun it is. We'll have some videos posted on the website so they can see what we did and what a great time we had. Yeah, and then we can definitely open it up to the boys as well, so boys and, and girls. And thank you to Tanya from Associated Consultants who is our karaoke queen tonight. Thank you all for coming. Let the games begin. Again, <laughs> continue. <laughs>